Hello, this is Mr. Buffington, and welcome to an episode of You're Doing It Wrong! Math Edition, featuring our famous Please Excuse My Dear Aunt Sally, which is totally wrong. Let's take a look at it. First off, Please Excuse My Dear Aunt Sally usually goes like this. P First we do our parentheses, or my grouping symbols, brackets. Next we do our exponents, then we do our multiplying, then our dividing then our addition, then our subtraction, P-E-M-D-A-S, PEMDAS, and this is wrong, error, 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 this is not how it actually works, so stop, if you are doing math that way, stop doing it, let me tell you how it really works, this is how it actually works, we do start off with our parentheses, that is true, and that moves on to our exponents, that's fine. But then we do our multiplication and division in one step, starting at the left, moving to the right. In other words, if there's division on the left of multiplication, you do the division first. If there's multiplication on the left, you do the multiplication first. Whichever comes left to right, multiplication, division, you start from the left to the right. Then you do addition, subtraction that same exact way. Addition, subtraction, one step from the left to the right. You might ask yourselves, what's the difference? Isn't it the same steps? Look at this. And I'm going to show you why it is not the same. With this simple question, 13 minus 5 times 2 plus 1. Simple um, arithmetic type question. I'm going to do the same exact question on the left and on the right. On the left, let's start off there. 13 minus 5 times 2 plus 1. There are no parentheses, there are no exponents, so we move on to our multiplication. 5 times 2. 5 times 2 is 10. Perfect. Over on the right, take a look. No parentheses, no exponents. Then we would do our multiplication and division in one step from left to right. And all there is is multiplication. 5 times 2 is 10. So we're looking very much the same so far. This is when things change a little bit. Go over to our left. We've done parentheses, exponents, multiplication. There is no division. Now we go to addition. So if you wrote it linear in a linear way like this, you would do your addition. 10 plus 1 is 11. That's addition. In the other way, on the right, we would look at addition and subtraction and start at the left, moving to the right, doing them in one step, basically. Addition, subtraction, that's all that's left? Great. Start at the left, move to the right. 13 minus 10 is 3. And in our final step, on the left, we do 13 minus 11, which gives us 2. And on our right, 3 plus 1, which equals 4. Different answers. That's what the difference is one of them will give you a correct answer this guy and one of them will give you the wrong answer this guy so that's what I'm telling you this is what we've been doing wrong when you write it out like that PEMDAS or you say please excuse my dear Aunt Sally or you somehow put it in that form it often leads to confusion so my recommendation is to do it this way with the multiplication division on top of each other, addition, subtraction on top of each other. That way they're looked at as separate steps. This is the correct way to do it. Again, writing it in a line like that has led to a lot of confusion. I am Mr. Buffington, and this has been an episode of You're Doing It Wrong. If you enjoyed that, go ahead and look at some of the other videos on this page. I hope that was helpful for you. Have a wonderful day.